So, Joe, that's a vital three points in, in, in our scrap towards the end of the season, isn't it? Massive for us, yeah, massive result. Obviously, we knew that it was going to be a, a strange game with the circumstances that Scunthorpe were in, but um, everybody around us obviously seems to seems to be getting points. But we've, you know, I think the manager's message to us is, is to worry about ourselves, and that was massive today. It was a really big result, obviously, at home. Um, and, you know, I think we're worthy, worthy winners in the end, really. And, you know, I mean, so you've had a lot of central midfielder partners this year, um, this season. Um, you and Henry are really kind of trying to starting to form a bit of a bond in there, aren't you? With a few games together now, and performing well both. Yeah, we're trying to. Yeah, Henry's obviously a, a fantastic player with loads of energies. Um, had a great career so far. He's obviously come from you know a high level with, with the way he's played, and um, we seem to understand one another. It's you know it's difficult to. Um, to gel immediately, obviously, like that, and, and we seem to be a new team that's obviously with, with a new manager that's, that's trying to grasp the way that the manager wants to play as, as quickly as possible. Um, since he's come, I think obviously you know we've, we've got some positive results. If you know if we'd have, if we'd have beaten the Oval at home, I think uh, you know the return from from those three games would have been would have been great. But um, we are where we are, obviously, and that's not just me and Henry. It's sort of all of us trying to trying to blend and and. You know, create some sort of dynamic that we can continue to create chances and, and obviously keep clean sheets over and in the pitch. So, um, yeah, I've obviously had a, a, a few, but um, all of them are you know good players, good guys, and, and hopefully we can obviously continue to, to have a nice partnership to the end of the season. One of those, you know, starting to blend is, is the strike partnership as well between you know Tav and Jack. They both got their first goals on Monday. Tav getting another one again, so that's always good to see. Isn't it? It's not easy. Is it? It's not easy to to just throw a couple of guys together and. And obviously expect them to do well. Obviously, Jack's come with a. When you obviously take a player from another team, that that comes with certain expectations. But I think Jack's managed to deal with them quite well. And obviously, his performance and his goal at, at Eastley were doing the world of good. But it's not been easy for Tav. You, you know, I don't think people understand that Tav's come obviously from from a club on loan where he's he, he wasn't playing for a long time. He was injured, and, and he's he's come really not having all the match sort of like minutes that you that you'd that you want a striker to have and he's had to come in and, and there's been a lot of pressure on him to, to hit the ground running. Um, I think he's doing a great job. You know, he's, he's obviously a focal point for us up front. It's very difficult to, to deal with. Obviously we saw today um gone for two centre halves are, are big guys. Um, and Tab did a great job. Um, so you, you know considering the circumstances and, and the sort of the Situation he was in at his previous club, I think he's done him uh, and done a really good job. And, and another goal today, which was well taken. You know, it's not easy when a ball comes back at you to, to get a clean strike on the ball. So it's a great finish, and you know, I'm sure in the next and the last three games he'll be looking to score more goals. Obviously, on Monday that comeback draw against Eastleigh was big, and today as well. You know, maybe after half time, them getting back in the game could have rocked us a little bit, but we showed that fight, didn't we, to get back and get those three points. Yeah, I mean, like, what else are we supposed to do, Sam? Obviously, you know, it's where we are in the season for, for a reason. Like we've found it difficult sometimes to deal with those situations. Today, I think obviously the, the, the personality of the manager is is a positive one and, and drives us forward and, and obviously puts a lot of demands on the players to, to be on the front foot and could have easily, yeah, I don't want to say the word, taken a backward step when, when we conceded, but we, we didn't really. Um, I know we, it, obviously the manager is focused on this on our home record and, and how we've obviously not been able to to win many points in not just this season but I think over, uh, historically over the last few. So it's something we want to really rectify and, and that ability to you know to get over bumps in the road, should we say, and, and conceding goals um, is something that we need to be much better at um, and something that we did show today. So yeah, fair play. It, it, in the end, obviously in those moments. Especially a free kick so close to the goal um, on the edge of the box, you know everybody almost expects a, a goal-scoring opportunity to be created. It's not always the case. So fair play to Ollie Harfield. I think he, you know, he's created chances all season, and Tyler seems to be able to, to head them in. You know, most more often than not. So it was a good goal for us. Click here for the latest match highlights and click here to subscribe. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.